Well, you know, even as things start to heat up, our roads may still be slick and some may be closed due to those downed power lines and tree branches. Elise Haas is live on the road now in Mobile 6. And Elise, where are you and how's it looking out there? Ken, we have a nice slippery wet mess out here in southeast Portland. And so we are taking it on the back roads right now just to give you an idea of what a lot of people are dealing with. And this has been, like we've been telling you um, in our morning newscast, the most treacherous part of it all. So we've been driving around. We've watched some people on this street um, work for about an hour to get their cars unstuck from the icy mess. And some were successful. Others threw their hands up and just gave up. So, you know, it definitely takes a little bit of skill to make it through this kind of snow and ice. It is a little bit easier, would you say, Jay, right from this morning, because things have thawed out a little bit more. We're now hovering more towards like 37 degrees out here versus 35, 34 this morning when we were first out driving around. But this area that I'm in, we've also noticed is also without power. So we're about to turn on to um, Milwaukee, Southeast Milwaukee. You can see people trying to stomp around in this slush too. So yeah, getting over these berms is also tricky because you have lots of traffic coming as well. And this is why if you are stuck on a side street, you know, really good luck. But if you look just a little bit ahead here, we're gonna make our turn. Look how much different this is, Ken and Jenny, from just that side street right here we go a little bit of relief well not for this guy oh no jet is stuck our friend over to the right is spinning we might give him some space but i'm telling you if you drive if you drive a, a sedan good luck really trying to, oh i'm rooting for you man jay should we go around and what should we do well we might have to come back and give our jet a friend a push yeah they're waving us on waving us on all right good luck good luck okay so you can see that's what people are dealing with. There's so much snow that's shoveled off onto the sides of the road. If you look up and you might be able to notice all of the lights, uh, traffic lights, they're off. So everybody's, you know, doing their best to watch out for one another, but you can definitely tell things are starting to melt. This area here at the intersection of Milwaukee and Bybee, turn it into, oh, turn it into a bumpy, slushy mess. So stay safe if you're going to be driving in southeast Portland. We've also seen a lot of downed trees. We've seen a lot of branches. Things are melting, so be aware to look up. Stay away from trees if you can. And honestly, stay off the roads as well. Um, my my brother-in-law said, if you do have to drive, you should make sure to pretend like your grandma is sitting in the back seat <laughs> holding a bowl of hot chili that's not covered. So make sure not to spill on her. Stand like don't drive at all. That's the advice that we have for you today. And I'll leave you with one down tree off on a car to the left there. Ken and Jenny? That was good advice. <laughs> for sure. Yeah. All right. Very descriptive this afternoon, yes, at least. Yeah, you really are. That's excellent. Yeah.